and that's how you count fast. So black has 78, make sure you remember, because I'm terrible with remembering numbers, I always have to recount. <laughs> Alright, so for white, this is going to be a little bit more complicated. Where is the edges of the territory for white? Well, uh, first off, the ones that I notice are going to be right here mm -hmm. and right here. Uh-huh. So, these are the edges for white. Now, there's also one thing I want to mention. Later, or, um, black can do this, right? And then white has to connect. And then white has to go down, so this is... So they lose that one because... Right, this is not a point, also, because black can take this point. These shapes are, um, make sure you're not... These are another kind of things that you take off, are when you can threaten to cut and force them to connect. So you gotta look for cutting points right. to know what you don't count. So go down, and also don't take away that one. And we're gonna take away that one when we count two because black can cut. Well, no, no because that's not is... cut. That's tag as well. Okay. If black goes in, you just eat gotcha. It. So down, take away that one. Um, where else? Uh, well, of course the on this side over here, uh, that's the line, mm -hmm. and then we've got to look inside here. No, but, these oh, are that's dead. a dead shape in there. So Those, you don't count anything in here because that's all yours. Because so, those are dead. So white's shape goes all the way around here. Uh -huh. And then we've got to look at this space right here because... Right. is this Sente if black plays there? If black plays here, then white has to play here. Right. Too. So this is the edge for white, not this one. So right. right here, right here, right here, right here, and right here. Where else? Well, then we've got to look at this in here because black has the shape in the No, middle. this is black. It's not white's. Right. So the line for white over here... Uh, we it's just these, these two stones. Spaces. These two spaces are dame. So we don't count dame. these are at all. Yeah, because both black and white are touching these two spaces, so it's dame. Nobody's points. Gotcha. And then over here, this is sealed off, so we just uh, count these points. Focus on this one for now. We'll do that one okay. in a minute. Well, then we've covered everything. Uh, um, right, so. right here and up here. Okay. Um, right here, it's pretty simple. Where's the edge? Well, we talked about these two spaces not being counted, and then if white plays right here... Uh, uh, let black play first. Okay, so black plays right here. Then white has to play right there, so we don't count that space. Right. We count from in there. Right. So there's a line up here, over here. Um, black has this corner, so white would stop counting. Uh, I don't think there's any points in here yet. I mean, white can play a move and get points. Right, but there's nothing. Oh, well, sorry. Um, I think there's one point right here. Yeah, I was thinking of that. Because this so, is all Because if black goes right there, then white goes right there, and you have one point. Right, it's not a false eye because it's connected. Yeah, so we'll count one point right here. That This shape gets a little confusing. This will take you getting stronger and being able to read the moves and see the shape afterwards. Um, it'll be easier to count the more you can read. Uh, so, But this will be... an. This is just the gist of it, and you can practice as you get stronger. So, um, I want to say you, this is not a point, because if white, black goes there, white goes there, and then black can go there, and then force white to either capture these two stones or fill in that point. So, okay, so let's say, let's not count that, um, just for video sake, it. because I know people are going to be arguing with me if I do something wrong. <laughs> uh, I've already got a lot of that before. Uh, so there, 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 there. This is not a point, right? Uh, well, it, it's connected to this, so it's not a false sure? eye. What if that goes here and here? Oh, then... White has to fill in. And well, even what, if white does something over here, you're still going to have to fill in eventually. I see. So that's a false eye. Okay. So you don't count that one either. So here, 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 here. Yeah, don't count that. Anything right there. Then there. And that should be it for this. All right, so let's go ahead and count this. And if you need help right here, just let me know. And just count every point in here is a point and two points for each black stone. Okay. Including these. Okay.
So there's 78 from for this section right here. Uh, I don't know. I just counted the whole thing. Oh, you already counted it? <laughs> yeah. You're horrible. <laughs> and then 86, and then that's 96, 97, 99. Plus I can't four. listen to your. I don't want to lose my number. <laughs> The numbers going through my head. I think I counted around 107, 108. I'm just. I got 108. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so I got 108 for this. So this should be easy to count because everything's already sealed. So how mm -hmm. many points in there? Uh, five. Nope. Wait, one, two. Yeah, five. No. Two, four, five. Six. Oh, I'm. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. You're right. <laughs> so 108 plus six, that's. 114. 14, yeah. I was at the four part of just getting to the team. Just bear with me. All right, so white has 114, black had 78. Mm -hmm. I remember, yay. All right, so 114 to 78. And um, that's how you count. Um, now, one thing I did not get to go over is how to count while you're playing out. That can get more complicated and um, I don't wanna really wanna teach that right now because in the middle of the game, you're going to be counting what is points and stuff that's not points yet. You don't count because you just say that this territory, if I seal it off, is worth this much. And if uh, he seals that off, it's worth that much. So do I reduce his or do I uh, seal mine? But it's not territory yet because Black will still be able to come in. That's why I played it out so much. I could have stopped like way back when, but then we had so many questionables and ifs. That's why I kind of played that move. So that way I can make this mine, so that way people can't say, what if black comes in, because I know black can live. And it's true black can live, I'll just make up these points somewhere else. Um, so in the middle of the game, what you want to try to do is count what is points, and once you get used to that, you can start putting value on moves, and you can see how much a move is worth and how much that'll affect the score and balance of the game. Now, after you get to a like lower single digit hues, you can take it one step further. And then you can say, even if black does come in here, I will make up um, a good example of be, let's go ahead and stop this because I'm ahead, right? Yeah. Yeah. Um, let's go ahead and say you have this shape on the side of the board. Now this shape you can say is worth at least 10 points. Now while it's true black can come in, you should be able to make up these 10 points somewhere else by attacking this black stone. That's the idea of this shape. Uh, when you get stronger, you'll be able to see that because you'll be able to see where you'll get the 10 points at or you'll get something out of it. You'll either get a wall that you can use to invade, which is also worth 10 points. You can get, um, and if they mess up and die, then you get more than that. But anyway, um, so I can say this shape is worth at least 10 points, not including the corner. So that's how you try and guesstimate and counting moyos is something you're just going to have to learn when you get stronger. Putting a value on an influence and wall and thickness is you're just going to have to learn as you get stronger by playing and see how much it affects the rest of the board. Like black could have a whole wall right here. Then it's going to be worth jack crap because if black comes in there's nowhere else to make the points. You got to make sure that you have a way to make up the points somewhere else. Like over here, if black comes right here and you both chase out, you'll get the 10 points on this side instead of this side. So it all comes with being able to actually being able to see ahead in the game and seeing what kind of what kind of things will happen. So, well, um, just keep practicing with it. You'll get better as you practice, and um, I hope this helps. And I hope I didn't confuse the crap out of everybody. And I hope you enjoy. Thanks.